can you? Do you want mustard? I want it all. Today's episode, I do something that I don't normally do. I show you a bit of my family life. My mother is just a wonderful woman. <laughs> and I have this North Carolina accent, I don't know why. <laughs> but she's worked so, so hard all of my life. She and my father to make me and my brother's lives amazing. Um, she went back to school, finished her bachelor's degree, got certified as a teacher, and put in her time for retirement. And I saw all of this during my childhood. Like it's amazing. So like for her to have had time to raise a family go back to school she did night school for like so two years to finish her bachelor's degree and worked a full-time job and cook and did anything else that we needed yeah sometimes she had to hold down the whole house because my dad would be overseas he's a marine he was a marine so when he would be overseas she'd have to hold it all down and whoop our butt and make sure we did the homework and da 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 so she's just amazing um so when it came time for our retirement i'm like okay i'm not big on party planning it's not something that i enjoy not even when it's for myself i don't like parties um it's just i don't know it's just me but for big milestones like when my dad retired from the military we put on a party and when my mom was about to retire i'm like okay we have to do a party not just because she's retiring but because like what this means like she has done it she's done such an amazing job at making all of her dreams come true she's always wanted to be a teacher since she was a little girl and she did it um it didn't happen overnight um it, it took her a while to get there like she we were in maybe i think i was in middle school when she went back to school years went by for her to before she was able to uh, attain that dream so that inspires me with my music career and with all the other dreams that I have like it's not gonna happen overnight but you can't give up the race is not given to the swift nor to the strong but he that endures to the end and she did so we salute her and I put on a party for her and invited all of her old colleagues from her job and from our church back in Jacksonville North Carolina Also accompany one of my voice students to one of her concerts. Her name is Naima. She's an amazing songwriter and singer and artist and just a really cool girl. And uh, yeah, she did a really great job. My wolf and I. Is the back hatch unlocked? Naima is on vocal rest, so she's not going to be talking until a few hours before the show. And her mother is back here chilling, doing a little work. We're on our way to the Naima Music Show. <laughs> yeah. At yeah. Trying to get in the light. The dance oh, here. The dance Yes. Yeah. She's going to rock. She's going to rock and roll. Have you started your warm up process? No. Mm -hmm. And 
one of my favorite people in the whole universe, Angela Johnson. She's one of the most multi-talented musicians and artists that I've met. She's a producer, she's a pianist, she's a singer, she's a mom, she's a vegan chef. <laughs> she's just a wonder woman. Uh, and I, I love working with her. We've done a few songs together in the studio. She produced and um, helped me arrange a song called Back in Time that I recorded with the Lithuanian soul singer, Germancha. We perform together from time to time and it's always a pleasure because she's such a pleasant, such a beautiful person. And uh, she was in DC at Blues Alley and she asked me to perform with her and I obliged. <laughs> forget guys love yourself love others and follow your dreams